What is going on guys? Tactical Bacon here and thank you very much for checking out today's video where I'm going to be explaining to you guys exactly what I've been doing the last week or so. I haven't just disappeared and kind of forgotten about the channel even though I haven't really uploaded any videos. I will get to that very shortly however. Let's explain where I've been. So about a month or two ago, my brother Christopher and my brother Tyler were planning a trip to San Francisco. Originally, they were planning a trip to Australia, but then it changed to San Francisco, I'm assuming because it was a little bit cheaper. And they asked me if I wanted to go. At the time, I was trying to plan a move, but unfortunately, that kind of stuff fell through, temporarily at least. So I decided to tag along with them on the trip to San Francisco. Got on the plane in Raleigh pretty early in the morning, as you can see. And we uh, we were flying to Seattle where I had a hour and a half layover Unfortunately, it kind of stretched out to about two hours due to weather conditions in San Francisco But I did get a chance to see I'm not sure if this is Seattle or Tacoma I know it's one or the other hopefully someone could tell me in the comment section down below But I did get to see it from the sky at least um, and even though we were able to board the plane, unfortunately, we had to wait for about an hour to an hour and a half before takeoff. But fortunately, we were able to take off after that. And flying over California was just beautiful. After that, on the first full day, we took a trip to the Golden Gate Bridge. That was the first thing that we wanted to see on the first full day there. And then we came across this bird who was eating what I think is fish, but I'm not exactly sure. It didn't look right. Then over there, uh, right in the same area that we were in, there was the Lucasfilm studio. Unfortunately, we were not able to do any video inside, so here's the Yoda statue. And then we did a Bay to Bay cruise, which was pretty cool. It was the first time I was ever on like a cruise boat, even though we weren't really going too far. Uh, we did get some pretty amazing shots of San Francisco from there. Uh, a whole bunch of like the tourist areas and all that kind of stuff. And just the entire city was just beautiful. I mean, this shot of the Golden Gate Bridge right here was absolutely beautiful from the boat. And then we went over to Pier 39 and saw some sea lions. And we, you know, we did some other tourist stuff over there, but you know, the sea lions were the coolest thing. After that, we went to Madame Tussauds where my brother jammed out with Jimi Hendrix. And I tried to look cool with Audrey Hepburn. Unfortunately, that didn't work out too well. The nightlife of San Francisco was live and vibrant. Uh, it was, I don't know, like things there were so much different than they are in, in North Carolina. And not just because of certain laws that they have in place or anything like that, but the nightlife was pretty cool. After that, uh, we went to Devil's Slide on our very last day. This is the Devil's Slide Bunker, the old World War II bunker. And just the beaches with the cliffs and the waves hitting the rocks. I mean, it was just such an amazing sight that you really don't get at beaches in North Carolina. Now, even though I had a blast in San Francisco, I was really happy to get home. Um, unfortunately, the room that we had gotten, you know, it was three of us. It was me, my brother Chris, and my brother Tyler. And unfortunately, there were only two beds in the room, so I opted to sleep on the floor. And let me tell you, after sleeping on the floor of a hotel room for four nights, it was very, very nice to get home to my bed and actually spend a night or two in it. But I did have an amazing time out there. You know, we went to Alcatraz. We did the whole, we did pretty much everything that most tourists do when Chinatown and all that kind of stuff. I ended up taking more pictures than I did uh, video because trying to work on my photography skills a little bit. And if you guys want to check out any of those pictures, there will be a link in the description to a photography website of mine. But the thing you guys are probably wondering most about is when are there going to be more like DayZ videos? When are there going to be more PUBG videos? When are there going to be more Arma 3 videos or just video game videos in general? There are going to be a couple of PUBG videos coming out later this week on Wednesday and Friday. So, <coughs> <coughs> and then next week we are going to have more Daisy videos. I know that you guys have been wanting more Daisy vanilla videos, and I'm sure that you guys are wondering about the next season of Overpock. 
Rest assured, we are currently working on all that kind of stuff, but it does take a little while to get together, seeing as TDR kind of died off, and we're somewhat still looking for another server, and also kind of found one, but it's kind of fucked up. I, I don't know, I'll, I'll, I'll explain all that kind of shit later for you. But anyways, guys, thank you very much for checking out this video. Check back on Wednesday for a new PUBG video. And like I said, on Friday, we're going to have a new PUBG video as well. Next week, we're going to have more Daisy videos and all that kind of good shit. Anyways, that's going to do it for this video. Thank you guys very much for checking it out. And until next time, stay classy.